Thanks. I think I'm gonna just rock out raw dog. Now. Raw Duna, yo. All right, y'all niggas, yeah. Raw dog, yo. Butt naked. I'ma rock out butt naked, yo. Ass out, cheeks out, nigga. New no shit. Now, <laughs> don't forget, too. You promised me a lap dance later, cause my man's at the bachelor party in another you state. Don't Let me get my lap. Don't get too excited. Get my lap dance. Grand Theft Auto. Oh, 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 I forgot to mention that. Y'all forgot to mention that. Hold up, bring it up, bring that back. All right, all right, let's get to the story first. T, don't let me forget about that. GTA 5 is out on deck. All the stream, hit me up if y'all want to get on a rampage together. And, and hold up, hold up. Rewind. Rewind. Cheers of a rampage, man. If y'all want to rampage together. Also, I got the cheat codes on deck. Yo, we could be online with unlimited weapons, unlimited health, unlimited lower and stars, all that. I got all the codes on deck. Stream, let's get a little team. Let's get a, let's get on this Grand Theft Auto shit. Let's have a little fun. Now, back to the back back to the question. Rewind. Back to the question. Cass was hitting me up asking me why did I start doing YouTube videos? And let me break it down for y'all real quick. This is the this is the only time I'm gonna explain this shit. All right, so this is let this this is big. They go, I just looked over to they too. They go your Yeti sticker over there too. I just looked over. <laughs> your Yeti sticker. All right. Everybody got it on the back of your I, I, I got the shit on the back of my note, yo. That's why I leave this case on. I got a Yeti sticker on the back of this shit. All right. Let's get into this. Now, what made me start doing YouTube videos? I'm gonna keep it real, which I'm gonna tell you the whole story. All right. Rewind. Let's rewind back to let's see, maybe 2005, 2005, 2006. I already had a YouTube channel. Now, my YouTube channel didn't even have a name. I think I signed up under it as a bootleg account. Like I didn't, I didn't, I wasn't planning on making YouTube videos. I had a YouTube account that I was using just to save videos. So what I would do is, and and niggas that know me know ever since maybe 2000. Remember, T, I showed you that video. I had a video called Keeping a Gangster 2000 where I just took a video camera and I took it with me every day to the hood, to the gym, you know, rolling dice. Everywhere I was at, I had the video camera. I've always been a nigga that liked videotaping shit and go in my crib and watch it later. Like, I'll, I'll videotape a whole day, then go in the crib, roll something up, have a drink, and watch the shit. I bring the I bring the camera with me when I'm with my boys and we snapping on each other. Then I, I, I rewind it and watch the, watch all the jokes and all that shit. Whatever. So I was, I was always doing that. When I found out about YouTube, I found out that you could upload. Now, you know, I was kind of noobish when it came to all that internet shit. I wasn't really too much internet warrior back then. You know what I'm saying? So I found out that you could upload the videos to YouTube and it'll just save on YouTube. So that means anywhere that you can access YouTube, you can access your video. So I was like, this is cool. So we went to the Puerto Rican Day Parade. We on the train, me, Dave, Vic, Low, Mike T, the whole squad. We on the train, I, I, I forgot what phone I had. I'm videotaping, I'm freestyling, Dave freestyling, Mike freestyling, we on the train, yo, straight going crazy. We drunk, having mad fun. I said, okay, good. Now I can videotape this shit, upload it to YouTube. Then later on, if I'm chilling at Vic Crib, I can jump on his computer, pull up YouTube, and show him the video. If I'm at Dave Crib, whoever crib I'm at, I can just go on YouTube and show them the video without having to save it in my phone. So that's why I started saving videos to YouTube. Now, I didn't know nothing about channels and subscribers and views and all. I didn't know about that. Didn't care about that. Then I, I just happened to be one day, I said, you know what? I'm going to try to get a little more computer savvy, try to get more into this internet shit. And I looked on YouTube, and I realized that I took a video one night. We was in the club, me and my man was mad drunk, my man was stumbling all over the place, so I took out my camera, and uh, my man fell asleep in the club, and we robbed him in the club, but I videotaped it, so I'm videotaping, me and my boys, we took we took the nigga's chain off his neck, we go in his pockets, we took his pockets, and you know, yeah, niggas in the hood, y'all know what rabbit ears is when you leave a nigga pockets out, out like that, they call that rabbit ears, so we rabbit ears, the nigga pockets, yo, and all that, I'm recording this shit, I'm giving narration, I'm like, look at this bitch ass, bum ass nigga, even though it's my dude, I'm like, this dumb ass nigga, yo, we about to rob this nigga, about to put this nigga in the back alley, I did all that shit, I recorded it, I up uploaded it to YouTube, and I didn't even put an official title on it, I just saved it as me robbing my boy in the club. Right? So this way, when I get to niggas' house and I want to find it throughout all of my YouTube videos, I don't know where to find it. So one day, I'm sitting at my man Dave's house, and I'm on his computer. I'm setting up his MySpace shit. I'm showing him how to do the little uh, sparkly... <laughs> remember when you used to have the sparkly little, hello, how you doing, sparkly shit, you know? So I'm setting up MySpace, showing him how to do it. I click on my YouTube shit. I look at the video. 
I just happen to look at views and I see the the video have like 50,000 views or some shit. I, I noticed I had like, I don't know, like maybe a couple of hundred subscribers. And that's from all the videos that I've been putting out before that. Like just videos I would title Drunk in the Beamer, Drunk in the Club, Drunk in, Drunk in the Strip Club. And I noticed that people was leaving comments under the video. So I said, oh shit, I didn't even know that. So I happened to start scrolling down and reading the comments and mad people was like, yo, son, this shit look like mad fun. Yo, yo, you a cool nigga and all that. I'm like, oh shit. Like, you know, you get a little bit of love on YouTube. Then at the same time, there was a lot of niggas that was like, oh, bitch ass bunky, go back to Africa and all that shit. I'm like, oh, like niggas, like you niggas could just leave comments and shit. So immediately my normal response is go back in. So I'm telling niggas, go eat a dick. I'm calling niggas faggots and all kind of crazy shit. I'm going too crazy with the comments. Niggas reporting my shit. I'm catching YouTube strikes. I didn't even know what that means. I just get an email like, oh, you got a strike on YouTube. I didn't even know what that means. I didn't care. Who cares? Then I took my 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 other man. We went to the strip club. I took the camera with me. We just wilding out in the strip club. There's nothing, nothing fancy, nothing going down. But I upload a video and you can see like titties in the video. Somebody flagged the video. That's another strike. Then before you know it, one of these days, I just go to click on my YouTube account. Yo, I get it's like, yo, this like, this channel is closed. YouTube channel is closed. I'm like, what the fuck? So I go and do a little research. Come to find out I had three strikes. Channel got closed. I'm like, damn. Now, I didn't really care about that, but I cared because I thought that I was saving all of my videos on YouTube. So all of those videos I save, I delete it from my phone. I delete it from everywhere. So I'm like, damn, that's all of the nice videos I had of me on the train, freestyling with my man. Those classic videos I can't get back. So I'm like, damn, yo. I'm like, all right, so no, now I'm going to start another YouTube channel. And this time I'm going to keep it a little bit more clean, all right? No titties, no, um, no, um, no, no me wilding out, you know, going too crazy on niggas in the comments and all that. Whatever, even though, you know, I'm an impulsive nigga. Like, I, I, I can't help it. I, but, but I can't help it. But I'm like, I'm going to try to calm down a little. So I started another channel. That's why if y'all look at my channel now, I said I'm going to start another channel. Call it Flossy Carter. That's what everybody calling me in the hood. I'm going to start that channel. I'm going to keep uploading my same videos. So if y'all notice, my first video is called uh, Racing in my BMW, Racing in the BM or some shit like that. And that was the same shit. It was, I'm chilling with my boy Vic. We we, we driving home. He won a race. He tried to get cute. I had to hit him with the whip bop. You know what I'm saying? I had put him in the Don't Make a Move files, yo. I, I beasted on him. I, had, I think I had a little Blackberry on me that day. I recorded that shit. And I said, okay, I'm going to upload it to, video, uh, to YouTube and save it. This way now I can save videos online without taking them space in my phone. Because y'all know back then, you know, there was, you know, years ago, there was no 128 gig memory cards and all that. Yo, memory cards was like 512 megabytes, yo. You know what I'm saying? You can't be saving mad videos on your phone. That shit would eat up your whole phone. Whatever. So I uploaded that video. Now, this is where the story gets interesting, all right? This is where, this is where we get to the tech shit, all right? So... Fast forward, I'm working. This is now. This is um. This is right around the time I met T. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to T. High five, T. Let me high five. Yeah. All right. This, 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 you know what I'm saying? This is. <laughs> I met T. Yeah, All right. All right. That's it. I'm gonna take it like that. Matter of fact, let's sip up, yo. Sip up. Sip up. Oh shit! Hold up. You gotta hear that? What's next? Oh. Um, All right, so now I got the new YouTube channel started. I got the racing in my BMW video. I got the um, Amaya dancing with Jamil video. You know what I'm saying? Amaya was like two years old dancing in the video. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Work. Can't yeah, you just do some crazy shit? And that's what I just I said. I just got the blue. Shout out to Amaya. All right. I just got the blue M3. I'm in the driveway. I got Amaya dancing with the music on. I'm having that fun. I'm uploading a couple of videos just for me to save. Don't plan on doing no reviews, none of that bullshit. Now, I'm in my new job. I just started a new job. That's the job I met T at. I'm in my new job. I met, you. <laughs> <laughs> I, I met T at the job. I'm, I, I'm on the French fry machine. T, T is on the register. I, <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm, I'm on the fridge machine. T was on the register. T, 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 T
was ringing up them Happy Meals all day, mad fast. I'm on the French fry machine. I'm catching mad oil burns and shit because I don't really know how to operate that shit. Remember, I was putting cocoa butter on the burns. T was putting cocoa butter on my burns, you know what I'm saying? When I put too much salt on the fries, T was like, yo, chill out, son. You put too much salt on them fries. I don't do that. Anyway, so now I'm sitting at my desk and I'm just chilling. Matter of fact, I got to tell y'all, I got to tell y'all the full story, all right? I gotta tell y'all the full story. T, T gotta go to the bathroom. Don't kill me when you walk past. Cause yeah, T like T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T T I already got one or two videos up. Everything's running running smooth. It's all good. And I'm getting turned up. Who cares? Now, one of these nights now, this is like, this is maybe like 2006. I'm outside. I'm rolling dice with one man on the block. I got AT&T. Now, I've, I've always had maybe two or three phones at a time because, you know, I'm, I'm, I've always been into technology shit. And especially when it came to cell phones, I've always liked to have a bunch of phones because I like to play with a bunch of different toys. So I had a couple of AT&T phones that at, at this very day, I'm on the block, I'm rolling dice with my man. Now, the AT&T, I had the Sony, I had the, the Ericsson, I had the Nokia joints, I had all of these little flip phones and brick phones, I had all these corny phones and shit. I, I had the last phone I had with AT&T, Catch that rock, my, rock with my videos, and y'all know me. I always say I don't fuck with AT&T. It's not that I don't like AT&T, but I had a bad experience with them. Because I did have AT&T. The last phone I had with them, y'all remember that silver flip phone? It was mad shiny. It was a Motorola. It was the joint Tony Soprano had, the last Tony Soprano phone. That little Motorola shit. Chris had it too. If y'all right, y'all watch the Sopranos, y'all know what I'm talking about. I had the Tony Soprano phone, right? Now, y'all remember, no camera, no ringtones, nothing. Just a regular phone. So I'm rolling dice with my man. We out on the block. We having mad fun. My man is flat broke. He getting ready to go home. He's dead broke. Now, I'm rolling. He said, yo, he want to bet me $100 on the roll. I'm like, dude, you, you, you broke. You don't got $100. So he's like, yo, I'll put my phone up right now. It's collateral or whatever. So he put his phone down on the floor. We clowning this nigga. We playing. We, we having fun. Okay, let's roll and shit. His phone is on the floor. I'm rolling the dice. As I'm rolling the dice, he gets a phone call, all right? And when the phone rang, it was the Biggie Smalls ringtone for, uh, for I think it was, um, um, I love it when they call me Big Papa, all right? Now, y'all remember when ringtones first came out? It wasn't the actual song. It was like the MP3 ringtone, just the beep, 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 you know, just the beep sound, but in, you know, in the sound of music, if y'all know what I'm saying. Like, it was in like a music ringtone like that. All right, so the music ringtone went off. I'm sitting there like, I'm like, yo, hold up, time out. I just stopped in the middle. I'm like, yo, I, I heard it. It sounded like like B.I.G. I'm like, yo, what was that, yo? He's like, yo, my Sprint phone, they got ringtones now. Now, I'm like, hold on a second. I'm, I, that moment, I was like, I want that. I must have that. I'm going to Sprint tomorrow. So the next day, the very next day, I, I, I'm telling all my boys, I'm like, look, I'm selling this AT&T phone, whoever want it. I, I say y'all the phone, the contract and all that. I need to get Sprint because I want that ringtone shit. I must have that. So my man Kirk was like, yo, I'll take that, um, I'll take that AT&T phone off your hand and the contract and all that. Shout out to Kirk, bitch ass nigga. I'm still looking for Kirk. If I see you, Kirk, I, I'm Kirk. If I see you, Kirk, you better stay in Jamaica, all right? My man Kirk, I saw, I sold him the AT&T phone. I called AT&T. I told him to put the phone under this nigga's name and all that. I'm giving him the phone and the contract. This nigga called in Jamaica, $2,000. Now, next month, I get a $2,000 phone bill. I'm telling AT&T, like, yo, I just switched this over to this nigga. Y'all gave it the green light and all that. They acting like they don't know what happened and all that. Like, a bunch of bullshit. That's why I was like, for mad years, I don't fuck with AT&T because I don't like how they treated me that day. Even though they told me that it was okay to give this nigga the phone and the con hit, you know, all he has to do is call them, which he did, and switch over everything. They give him the contract. I'm, I'm, I'm free and clear to go to get Sprint. Whatever. I digress. <laughs> Let me digress again. So anyway, so I told my boy, I was like, I need that Sprint phone with the ringtone. I need that ASAP. Very next day, I went to Sprint. I got that same phone. I think it was an LG phone. Now, I'm getting kind of turned up, so I don't remember exactly for sure. But I think it was an LG phone, this clear and blue shit. But it had ringtones. It was a silver and blue phone that had ringtones. 
actual ringtones that sound like that sound like rap songs. Y'all remember it had um Fabulous, Hollow Back, Young, and I had all of these little MP3 ringtones. It shit was crazy. So okay, cool. So now I'm into Sprint. All right. So back to the story. So now I'm into Sprint. So now I'm sitting at work at my desk, you know, minding my business. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm like, you know what? I told my man now, yo, T, you know, Vic used to work at Sprint. I don't know if you remember. Yeah, so Vic used to work at Sprint. Not the big Sprint stores, but he used to work in Rochdale, <laughs> in Rochdale Mall, in the middle of the mall, they had a little Sprint booth. So once I switched over to Sprint, you know, Vic was my dude. He knows that I like to switch phones every other week. No, not every other, <laughs> every other week. I like to switch phones every couple of months. Whenever a new phone come out, I'm getting that. And he knew that. So now I switch over to Sprint. So I told Vic, I said, yo, dog, whenever y'all niggas get a new phone, call me up. Put one to the side, I'm coming to get it that same day. And Vic was my dude, so he was like, cool. So now I'm switching phones back and forth with Sprint. Yo, the, the new camera phone came out. Y'all remember when um Sprint first got the camera phone? It was a uh, Sanyo, I believe. Sanyo made the first Sprint camera phone. I'm going on record. Y'all can check y'all can check the paperwork for yourself. The very first camera phone that came up from Sprint was a Sanyo phone. It was the flip phone that had the camera and the flash on the outside. I had that. As soon as the camera phone came out, I was like, I must get that. I went and got it. I'm taking mad pictures. At the time, when that camera phone came out, I was working on the ambulance still. Shout out to my moms. That, that was the first time that you had an actual phone with a camera and you could take a picture and email the picture to somebody. So I'm working on the ambulance. Every time I see something gruesome, I'll take a picture of it and send it to my mom's like, yo, check this out. Because my mom, she watched CSI and Law and Order. She, she like all that gruesome shit. So I'll be, I'll be taking mad pictures and be like, yo, mom, check this out. Yo, this is mad gruesome. And she's like, oh, my God. You know what I'm saying? It's whatever. Whatever. So I had a whole bunch of... I had, I had a, moms. Shout out to my moms. Yeah, right? Now, I had, so I had a whole bunch of Sprint phones. So now, back to the story. Back to the story. I hope I didn't lose y'all. Right? Matter of fact, let's have a drink. If y'all if niggas is drinking, y'all with me. Cheers to you, baby. Cheers, cheers to the stream, too. Stream, drink up. So now, why did I start making YouTube videos? So, I got Sprint now. I'm sitting at my office one day. I'm, in, I'm, I'm sitting at the desk. And um, I, had, I had four phones at that time. All right, I, I know for sure I had an HTC, the little Windows. Now, keep in mind, this is before Android was even invented. There was no Android yet. So I had the HTC Windows phone. I had a, a, um, the Sanyo Palm Pilot. I think I had a Trio Palm Pilot. And I think I had a, ne uh, a Nextel. All right, I went through every Nextel. I had every single hot Nextel that was out that was ever invented. I had those. All right, so I had four phones on me or whatever. I'm sitting at my desk. It's mad boring. I'm like, you know what? Let me just go on YouTube and look at some videos. Because, you know, that's the first time I decided to actually start watching YouTube and see what other niggas is doing. Not, not just what I'm putting out there. Let me see what other niggas is doing. So I start watching YouTube videos. And sure enough, I stumble across a channel that specializes in phones. And I'm like, oh, shit. This is what I like, phones. I see another nigga got a channel with phones. Let me see what he's talking about. So, now, y'all old school cats, y'all gonna know this channel, young niggas or y'all niggas that just got on YouTube, y'all might not know who I'm talking about, let's have a sh let's have a quick sip for my man Noah from Phone Dog, alright, y'all remember Phone Dog when, when Phone Dog first came out, alright, this is when Phone Dog first came out, y'all remember Noah from Phone Dog, it was a bald headed dude that wore glasses, he was kind of, you know, kind of you know, a little nerdy side, but down to earth, whatever. So I'm watching the phone dog video and they're talking about phones and shit. I'm like, yo, this is my new favorite channel. They're talking about phones. I love phones and gadgets and all that. This is my new favorite channel. That was the first channel that I ever subscribed to. So I hit the subscribe button. I'm like, bingo, I'm in there. I'm like, we're talking about phones. And keep now, remember, this is back in the day. Phone dog was mad small back then, yeah. So when you left a comment, niggas would actually comment back. So, you know, he Noah would put up a video and shit. And um, I'll leave a comment like, yo, you know, how much this cost? So, you know, some shit like, you know, we're talking about phones and shit. Niggas will be hitting niggas back and all that. I was like, I like this YouTube shit. This shit is mad cool. You meet niggas that have the same interests as you. I like this, yeah. Now, here's where it gets tricky. The HTC Windows Touch Pro 2 is coming out. No, not the Touch Pro 2. I'm lying. It was a, um, but I think that was the original HTC Touch. It was a, the HTC, now... I could have been more prepared. I would have had the pictures to show y'all, but, you know, I'm a noob like that. 
It was the HTC phone. It was it was a gray Windows phone that slides. It had a stylus on it. That phone was coming out next. I had the small HTC. Y'all remember? I think it was called the HTC Touch. It was like mad small. It didn't have a flip or nothing. It was a Windows phone. And um, it was just small. It had a black matte finish to it. It was real nice. So I had that phone and a bunch of other phones. But the HTC phone was coming out soon. So my man Vic called me on the phone. He's like, yo, Sprint got a new phone coming out. We just did our training for it. The shit is coming out next week. All right? So now I'm like, okay, cool. I'm going to get this shit. So I go on YouTube, and I see that phone dog got the phone before the shit is even out yet. So I'm like, yo, I'm blown away. Like, how the fuck they did that? Who, how they got the, the new phone, and then shit ain't even out yet? I didn't know nothing about, you know, companies that you could call a company, and they'll send you the phone to review and all. I didn't know nothing about that. So I'm like, oh, shit, this nigga went out. Maybe he got a hookup, and he got the phone early. I'm like, all right, cool. Let me see what he think about it. So, I'm watching the Noah from Phone Dog video, and he's like, yo, this, this HTC phone is popping. He's like, it has a stylus on it, it's mad fast, it's mad smooth, blah, blah, blah. Yo, I, meanwhile, I'm sitting there watching the video, I can't even contain myself. I'm like, yo, I can't, I'm calling Vic on the phone like, yo, son, the, the moment that that phone touches your store, call me, I'm coming to get it. I don't care if I'm working, I don't care if I'm in the gym, wherever I'm at, I'm dropping what I'm doing, come get that phone. Cool. Took about a week. Very next week, my man Vic called me the phone. He's like, yo, son, that HTC phone just dropped. We got it in the store right now. I put one to the side for you. Come get that. And the funny thing, T.L. was at work. I was, I was at work, and I, I, I called a cab because I didn't feel like going I didn't feel like going to get my car out of the parking lot and all this shit. I called a cab to the job, took me to Rochdale Mall. I went and copped the phone. Vic didn't even really, you know, I didn't really talk to Vic or nothing. I just said, yo, let me get that phone. I got to go back to work. He gave me the phone, bounced. I went back to work. Cool. I get in the office, I open the phone, I'm like, alright, this is going to be my new favorite phone. This nigga Noah from Phone Dog said this phone is hot. He said it's crazy fast, it's smooth, it, it's the shit, it's the new flagship from HTC. I'm, I'm, I'm in there. I open the phone, I start playing with it. The phone is lagging like a motherfucker. Now, y'all remember the old Windows phones? The phone is lagging like crazy. The phone is mad slow. The volume on it is mad low. Everything about the phone was just whack. Now, I bought the phone off contract like I've always been doing. The phone was like $500. Now, look, that, that, that lets you know. Remember back in the days, yo, a, a new phone came out. Even a top dog was like $495, $500. Not like now. Like this fucking shit right here. This shit, yo, if you buy this shit outright and you don't got no... <laughs> this shit going to cost you $1,000, yo, for the Note Edge, yo. A G. All right, so that's double the price. All right, so $500 for the phone. I just spent $500 and the phone was mad trash. Yo, I was so tight. I was saying to myself, why would this nigga do that? Why would this nigga make a video saying the phone was mad hot, saying the phone didn't lag, saying the phone, the volume was loud, everything was good? Why would he do that? And it's just the opposite. Mm -hmm. I was like, why would he do that? I was like, this shit cost me $500, yeah? You know what I'm saying? It's, I was like, yo, I was, I was mad tight. I was like, fuck YouTube, yo. Like, I'm watching all the other videos. Now I start searching. I'm watching all the other videos. I'm like, yo, everybody's saying this shit is hot, but this shit is mad whack, yo. Like, why would they do that, yo? I'm like, all right, so I do a little more research. Oh, okay. Come to find out, nigga got the phone for free. Oh, okay, nigga. Niggas, um, niggas working with the company. So I'm like, oh, okay, so this is not a real review. This is a commercial. I was like, okay, I, th I thought I was watching a phone dog review on the phone, but I was really watching the commercial. I was like, the nigga got me, nigga, nigga sold me, a, like a nigga made a commercial, and I'm just like that nigga in the middle of the night watching the commercial for TCI, that thing you're going to go to TCI and, yeah, and get some type of banging job after that, I'm, I was like, I got got, so I got mad, I said, you know what, the same thing that happened to me is going to be happening to mad people, and I don't like that, and T, you know, you remember we were just talking about that last night, I don't like bullies. I don't like. I don't like when people take advantage of other people. Now look, y'all can say what y'all want. You know what I'm saying? I'm a hardcore niggas, but I do got feelings. I hate to see people get bullied, and I hate to see people get taken advantage of. So I was like, damn, the nigga took advantage of me. They're gonna take advantage of somebody else too. I said, you know what I'm gonna do? I said the very next phone that comes out, I'm gonna buy it because I always get the new phones, and I'm gonna make my own video on it. And I'm gonna call it the real review, all right? Not just a regular review, the real review, all right? Not the not not the not the commercial review, not the review for you know niggas that getting it for free. This is gonna be the real review, all right? And T was IRT over there with the, with the applause. So I gotta drop that, but um, yeah. So that's how I said, all right. I said, fuck it, real review. Real review is coming out. 
coming soon, the next phone. So, the very next phone that came out was, I believe, the HTC, it was, either it was the HTC, the Touch Pro 2, or y'all niggas, go, go look at my old videos for yourself with the Palm, the Palm Pre, all it, the Palm Pre, the very first Android phone that ever came out with Sprint, that was the HTC joint, that's when Android was running Cupcake, the HTC Cupcake phone, I had that first, I had the, I was beta testing wow. Android too, y'all niggas don't know, T, you know too, cause T had, T had the, um, the side, the, <laughs> you had the Android phone too though, right? I had the HD, the HD too? The, the HD, the HD. That, that was this, that was this, that was this all the same time. So, the very next phone that came out, I said, I'm gonna go out, I'm gonna buy it with my own money, I'm gonna just go in my office, I'm gonna sit down, and I'm gonna make a video, just in case, if niggas is browsing, you know, YouTube looking for a review, they might see the phone dog shit, they might see all these other companies, you know, all these commercial reviews, then they might see a review from a regular nigga, who just happened to, you know, who trying to save y'all some money to let y'all know either the shit is good or the shit is, you know, the shit is not good. So, I think, I'm not sure I gotta, I, I, check my old videos for yourself, I don't know. I think it was the HTC Touch Pro 2. It was, um, one of these Android phones that came out and the Palm Pre. Those was like my first three videos. But when the phone came out, I was like, alright, now I'm gonna do a real review, alright? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna talk about all that consumer shit i'm not gonna talk about i'm not gonna spec you out of death with mass specs and all that i'm just gonna talk about the real shit does it really work and this is this way it saved y'all some money so i did those couple of videos and shit and you know i wasn't i wasn't planning on doing mad videos i wasn't i really wasn't planning on doing that i just kind of wanted to get mine back after i got jerked from phone dog i wanted to get mine back for the next couple of phones that came out so i did, i made those videos and then I started reading the comments on the videos. And mad people was leaving the comments like, yo, is yo, they like the video, they appreciate the shit. Mad niggas was like, yo, can't wait for the next one. So I'm like, damn, so niggas can't wait for the next one. I can't stop now because I got niggas like niggas that really want to see. And me, I like, you know, I've always been that nigga. People will come to my house, people call me on the phone and be like, yo, I heard this came out. They know I'm the tech nigga of the hood, even before YouTube and MySpace. Before. Niggas know that some new shit come out, I'm already getting it. So niggas will always call me, ask me for my, my advice anyway. So when I started reading the comments on the YouTube videos, I see a lot of people was like, yo, they want to know what I think of the next one that's coming out or what I think about this, what I think about that. I'm like, oh shit, like niggas actually care about my opinion. I now keep doing this shit. And I kept doing this shit. And before you know it, Started getting, you know, niggas, but the, the first video that really, that people, that people took really serious was my HTC Evo. When I did the Evo video, a lot of people started subscribing to the channel. And when I say a lot, I mean like I had like a thousand subscribers, you know what I'm saying? Like for me, that was a lot, a thousand, a thousand niggas that I don't know out of the, you know, online just hitting me up, asking me what I think about shit. So I'm like, all right, cool. I like this job. I'll give my opinion. And if y'all doing some shit, I'll watch y'all shit. And, you know, we, we go back and forth. And we're just keeping moving. So that's how I started doing the YouTube videos. That's what got me into the shit. Then, you know, um, <laughs> as we kept going, um, the, you know, y'all know the Piper Boy shit and all of the beef. I got into a little YouTube beef. Had to, you know say, had to revert back to my old ways again. You know what I'm saying? Got into that shit. But um, whatever. That's neither here nor there. I started having mad fun. I met Josh right around the time I, I did my HTC Evo video and the Evo shift. That's when I met Alfonso and Zito Max and all of them. Like, you know, we started becoming like a little community, a little family, yo. Like, we all started like, you know, regular niggas. Like, we wasn't these commercial niggas and we wasn't these niggas that trying to try to trick you into subscribing. Because I remember when when I had a thousand subscribers, a lot of y'all niggas don't know. Some of y some of these cats that y'all see that got mad subscribers, Back then, there was a shit that once you got like a thousand or two thousand subscribers, they these people would contact you with these subscriber bots, and they would be like, "Yo, you, you pay us a certain amount of money, you could get a hundred thousand subscribers, you could get fifty thousand subscribers for X amount of money," and I didn't do that. I could have did that because I and at the same time, I I seen a lot of cash that was going down. I seen a lot of cats go from from five thousand to fifty thousand subscribers overnight, five thousand to five hundred thousand subscribers in two weeks. You know what I'm saying? And there was subscriber bots, but I was like, I don't want that. I don't want quantity. I want quality. Because if y'all look right now, 
at, at my block list, the amount of niggas that I block from YouTube, I block niggas every day. Because it ain't about, okay, let me just let this nigga just keep saying what he want to say. Be, who cares? A view is a view. No. I don't care about a view. I block niggas every single day because I don't want the, 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 the quantity. I want the quality. So I started going through the comments and shit. I started responding to the comments and all that. Then I started building like a little YouTube family. You know what I'm saying? So I started getting my people that I see on every video, on every, you know, every video I make. I start seeing the same cats here and there. So, you know, niggas started pushing me and motivating me to keep doing videos. And that's that, that brings us to where we at now. Same shit. Y'all niggas don't know. I got a lot of... <laughs> I got a lot of offers. I, I got a lot of offers from a lot of these companies that y'all see right now. A lot of these channels that out right now. I got emails, and I'm not. Y'all know me. I don't be dropping names. I, I'm not a name dropping nigga. But I got a lot of emails from some of these companies that's out now. Some of these channels, like yo, um, they want me to work with the channel and this and that. And one of these channels, I actually was like, all right, cool. Like y'all niggas gonna pay me? I'm like, yeah, okay, like okay. <laughs> yo, if it's talking about money, I'm in there. Anytime I talk about money, I'm in there. I know I but the dude was like, look, you know, we could pay you and all this shit, but you got to clean up your act. I'm like, what you mean by that? You can't be telling niggas to go eat a dick in the video. You definitely can't be telling niggas to go eat a dick in the comments. You can't be doing this. You can't be doing that. And I was like, dog, let me, let me explain something to you. If I work at a job, my real job that pays my bills and niggas don't tell me what to do at my job, why the fuck would I be on YouTube, something that I'm doing for fun, something that I enjoy doing, I'm going to have niggas telling me what I can and can't say and how I can move, and this is what this was supposed to be my hobby, this is supposed to be what I'm doing for fun. So I had to turn a lot of niggas down, and like I said, I'm not throwing no names out there. I had to turn a lot of niggas down that asked me to make videos with them, asked me to, you know, do shit together, asked me to e even straight up work for the channel and all that, and I wish them well and all that, but... The channel that I have right now, and y'all seen the, 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 the little plaque and all that shit, like I said, that's for us. The channel that I have right now is for my down-to-earth cats, all of y'all regular cats, all the stream gangsters, all the stream team, all of the regular cats out there that just like to see a regular nigga doing regular shit, being himself. I don't got to be, you know, monitoring what I say. I get I get emails all the time, people saying, oh, can I not curse on the video? Can I not do this on the video? Can I not do that? And my answer to that is, no, I'm sorry, I, you, I'm, I'm not getting with no censorship shit because if that's the case, then I might as well just be like all these other niggas here. I'm not censoring my channel. I'm not making videos for little kids because little kids is not the ones that's going out and buying the product. So I don't make videos for little kids. I don't make videos for sensitive, emotional people. And all that. I make videos for my stream gangsters, hardcore niggas, real niggas on day. Now, T, let's have another drink. We're going to get into the, um, some of these products. I hope that answered your question. Shout all right. out to you, baby. Congratulations. Congratulations to me, you, and the team. Yo. Congratulations to the stream, all right? Because, look, like I said, that just proves that that we can we 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 can have a platform too. To us. That that exactly us. And when she says us, that means all of us. You know, all of me and you, the stream, all of y'all cast that subscribe to the channel. You know what I'm saying? I'm this 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 Hennessy right here is for y'all. That just proves that How about realness. Yeah, about for all the real niggas on. I just let you know that there's still room for real niggas to make their way into this tech shit like we making our mark in this shit like you know y'all see the, the all these um when y'all watch videos and y'all see all oh, these niggas everything every video is a commercial in my opinion there's no way you can review a phone in five minutes yo how you how are you doing that yo how can you review a phone in five minutes enough to make the average person at home go out and drop a thousand dollars now look look at this shit right here for this shit right here this is a thousand dollars all right, so how can I make a review on this in five minutes to convince you to go and get this for $1,000? That's not just me reading the Samsung spec list. $1,000? Nigga, for $1,000, before you spend $1,000, you want to know about the battery. You want to know about You want to know about everything inside, out. How does it work? You want to see the problems with it. You know, I could, like when I did that Samsung video, I could have covered up the Galaxy Note lag. I could have edited that out. But that's something that y'all need to see. You need to see that if you're not careful, your phone will lag. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, round of applause for all of y'all um, cats rock, rocking the stream. All y'all cats that subscribe to the channel. All of y'all cats that's down with the movement. That's for y'all. All right. Now, T just hand me some scum. <laughs> we got another drink. All right, let's get into um I hope that answered that. Let's get into the stream. Cheers for you, baby. Cheers. Let's get into the stream real quick. I gotta hit the head real quick. Um I'm gonna pause the video. I'm gonna hit the head. 
We're gonna get into the stream. Let's um let's check James Bond's status. It's two th two twenty seven. Yo, I'll be back in five minutes, all right? Okay, so we back. Let's see. All right, it's only only been a couple of minutes. Uh, let's let's check the. Uh, all right, two twenty nine, two minutes. Now I'm sending the tweet out. Now I, 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 I've been looking at the stream as we talk. Stream going crazy. All right, this is the, this is the tweet. We going live right now. Let's um let's take it to the stream. All right. Now for all of y'all cast that been hitting me up too, Ivan Mendoza, Frank, Dave, Keto. We're gonna get back to that. I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to get back. Let's um. Cause niggas been hitting me up for a minute, yeah. I'm, 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 I got a backlog. Let me see. I, I, I'm gonna start from now, and y'all know. Let me explain something to y'all how I work on Twitter too, cause I don't be on Twitter too much like that. Let me explain something to y'all how I work on Twitter. If I favorite your tweet, all right, that means I read it. All right? I'm not just favoring it for no reason. That means I read the tweet. I like the tweet. All right, that for me favoring the tweet is the same as liking the tweet. Yeah. A lot of times I'll be in the call, I'll be somewhere, I don't have time to respond to every single tweet, but if I favorite the tweet, that means I like it. If you send me a link or something and I favorite it, trust me when I tell you, that means I'm getting back to that link, I'm going to go check it out later, alright? So let's um let's see what we got on deck. My man Ivan Lopez, alright? What's up, Floss? Just checking in, wondering if you got any note edge cases on deck. Number sign stream gangsters, number sign team floss, number sign team chicken feet. All right, so <laughs> I, got, I got a favorite this one. All right? all right, yo, T, number sign team chicken feet. All right, so my man Ivan Lopez, that's you, that's, that's you, you T, that, chicken no, no, no. feet and bat, that, yo. That's you. <laughs> and bat, yo. That's, you, that's, and, that's Jose, yo. Slow Joe, look, Slow Joe, I see you with the chicken feet, you know. Stream gangsters, if he wanted, I'll cook it. You want a barbecue, teriyaki, I look that, I look I'm gonna, leave, it, I'm gonna leave that up to the stream. How you want stream, it? Stream, how stream, hit me that? up. If you want look, that, I'll, if, I'll, if I'll, I'll tell you like this. If you want it, I'll cook it. I'll tell you like daddy, this. If I get daddy, D E D D Y, D E D D Y. <laughs> if I get <laughs> yo stream, if I can, if I get, if I get twenty five number sign <laughs> floss eat a chicken feet, I will eat a chicken feet. T, I'm not look. And look, look, matter of fact, since this is a special and night, better the plaque again. <laughs> This is a special night, all right? Yes. This is a special night. We got the silver player. We got the 100,000 100, on deck, all right? Since this is a silver night, a uh, silver night. This is a special night. Silver night. Silver platinum night. night. Platinum night. Platinum night. I'm going platinum, you all right? Yeah. If this is a silver, silver, a special night, I'm taking special <laughs> requests. If I get 25 number sign for us eat the chicken's feet, I will, I promise, I you will gotta, have tea. You gotta tag us both because. Tag T, all right, Miss Tats. I'll, I'll, I'll leave no, a link. No, no, no. You didn't know. I didn't tell you. It's no more Miss Tats on, it's Miss Tats on Instagram, but it's Tanisia underscroll on, on. See, on, she said underscroll. That's two gills now. What the fuck is it? It's underscore, you yeah. See, now you only two gills. That's two gills. No, because you gill me in the front. You gill me in the front when you walk past. I don't, I be making, I be making, I be making bad mistakes. I be fucking up all the time. That's cancellation. Now, what was we just watching? What he said, he said, I be fucking up all the time. What was that? What was that? Chris Tucker, yeah? But he's like, I don't give a fuck. I be fucking up all the time. Confidence, confidence is the key. That, you know, if you say, <laughs> if you say the shit like you mean it, then niggas will be like, oh, okay. Oh, word. Like, oh, okay. It is lover. I, I, maybe it is lover. Yeah. Yes, okay. Slash that. One I, for you, two for me. Right. One, no, because you you got yours when you walk past to go to the bathroom. You try to kill. You try to kill that. me when Nobody you walk past. That. That's you Stream. saying that. That could be lies. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Stream, yeah, T, T. See, this is the shit I'm talking about. This is, this is, <laughs> Stream, this is the shit I'm talking about. Your yeah, 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 girl T, man. The girl T, be, 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 she play by her own rules, yo. And I respect that, yo. I respect that, yo. And um, also, if, if y'all didn't know. I just gotta throw a quick before I get back to the stream. T, it's Tuesday night. Let's, let's, let's bring night. it down. Let's bring it down. All night. Let's bring it down. Let's bring can it down. I ask one question? Yeah, what is it? Can I watch you play Grand Theft Auto? <laughs> can you watch? Can I watch oh, matter of fact, video? yo, hold on. Where is, I just had that. Where is it? It's over here somewhere. All right. It's right there. Under the oh, scarf. Okay. What stream. is that? The PLO? Under the PLO scarf. <laughs> stream. Look what your girl T got me today earlier. All right, now look. Y'all niggas, yo. 
I, I told y'all before, all right? If you're fucking around with a chick and she don't, she don't encourage you to have fun, she don't encourage you to enjoy yourself, you know what I'm saying? Then you're fucking with the wrong chick, all right? Now, shout out to T. T, I'm going to sip up for you. you. I'm going to sip no, up for you real quick. Let me sip up. up to you. 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 T is the type of chick. I didn't know nothing about this. T, just, T came home. I'm in the bed. All right, no, butt naked that. with a hoodie pause, on. Pause <laughs> I'm in the bed, butt naked with a hoodie on. I'm it's sorry, mad cold. I'm, I'm sorry. I had to actually unlock the door. You had the keys. <laughs> you had the car keys. Yeah, I, 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 I'm, I'm driving around T's car all day like a Let boss. Let me tell you, you know I what I'm we was texting, like honey knows what time lunch time is. Like, oh, what you doing for lunch? Like, oh, I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to eat. Like, oh, I'm on the train. As a matter of fact, I'm on the train headed over. Shout out to New York City Transit, MTA, because they got Wi-Fi on the train. <laughs> Wi-Fi on the train. You're like, Yo. what you about to eat for lunch? I'm like, I don't know. I'm in Best Buy. Excuse me, I'm in GameStop. Like, listen, let me. I went to the register. It was a line. I was like, let me get this book. Let me hold on to it just in case. I want to hold on to it while I'm online. Go ahead, baby. Yo, look, let me tell you. <laughs> yo, tri- <laughs> tri- like, what you doing? See? Like, oh, I'm getting lunch. Nah, she knows that. <laughs> e- even if, even if I never open this shit, even it if I matter. never read it. T knows that while I'm playing the game, this is the kind of shit I like to have close by in front of me. That's I don't it. care if I open this shit. I might not never it's read not this shit. That. I might not never read this shit, but look at this shit. Got all of the details for the GTA 5, <laughs> Xbox One. We're going in tonight's stream. We will form a team. If y'all want to do this, yeah, we will, we will get a team and we will rampage on. Like I said, I got all the cheat codes. All right. If you pre-ordered, you got a million dollars like me. <laughs> but if you don't, if you don't know how to get money, I'll show you how to get some money underwater. I'll show you how some steak shit. You get some money. But shout out to T because she just picked this up for me on the low. I did not expect this. This is exactly what I like. When I get new games, I got the Destiny one like this. I got the Mortal Kombat, the Killer Instinct, Street Fighter. I got all of the books like this. I got a Titan Four one that I never opened. <laughs> you know, whatever, whatever. But the point is. This is the collector's edition, I right? even if I even if I never use that shit. That's what the bookshelf look like. <laughs> exactly, exactly. I, 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 I like to have my my bookshelf. Look at that. I, even, I forgot about my watch. Don't let me have to go get mine. That was good. Yo, good. I, 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 forgot, I almost forgot about my watch. See, no, 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 I, 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 I like to rock three watches. I like to rock three watches right now. When I did the real review on that gear solo, niggas was like, somebody able to come and say, yo, the fuck, you got three three gear what three galaxy watches? Easy, you stupid. Your chain. I got you three got your galaxy chain. phones. What's stupid. With the other watch. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Look, we we, we having too much fun. Why do I have three gear watches? Because I got three watches. Stupid. Stupid. I got three Galaxy phones. Stupid. All right, all right, all right. In your face. Your man, no, I was. That's the dude's name. My man in your face retweeted retweeted the tweet. I see you. Let's see, my man Jess Ricky. I T what's up? You drinking or what? We have we we we, we getting turned yeah, up tonight. We, we getting turned up. We getting turned up. Let's <laughs> Where's your cat at too, by the way? Your, your cat been fucking with me all day. Sheepin'. Sheepin'. We gotta let them know. Ah, Alright. Let me plug in my camera, cause um my battery's getting ready to die. Let me plug in the camera. Real quick. Can you do me a favor? Can you wipe them white spots now? <laughs> oh you, you, yeah yeah your, your OCD kicking in too huh? Yeah. All right, T got OCD like me yo. We don't we don't like to see this type of shit. Let's um keep it nice and clean, keep it nice and classy, nice and smooth. All right. <laughs> nice and smooth. And once the camera goes off, ratchet. <laughs> Get man ratchet up in here. I'm pulling out my bandana. We I'm pulling out my suede ratchet. socks, and we get. Ratchet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pulling out my vest, my, my New York City hat, my Yankee hat, my vest. T got T got her Uggs and her uh, her tights. I don't do Uggs. Don't do <laughs> that's I no, but that's, 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 that's the I'm thought. Trying. That's the thought starter quick. So, so <laughs> no, I'm saying because you said the I got the ratchet kit, I got no, the no, puffy no, no, vest but, and that. You got the, this, the, the, why we both can't be thoughts. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. I got I said I got the ratchet kit. You got the thought shit. No, excuse me, that was a hit. Why we both can't be ratchet? Why we can't be Ratchet? Why I gotta be a thought? I'm not a thought. I'm ratchet with you. All right, so we we, we I, 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 you I be ratchet, I'll be a thought. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> niggas, yeah. niggas can Hold be on. thoughts too. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
Let's go, yeah. Oh, y'all thought niggas, yo. Shout out, shout out to the thought niggas out there. I see ya. Right. Hey, girl. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. If your girl, if your girl try to thought you out, nigga, yo, do what you. <laughs> right. Your girl might thought your ass out, yo. All right, look, 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 look. <laughs> what is T doing over there, yo? All right, so T just T put all this shit in one drink. T T just put all this shit in one drink. That you know. Whatever, stream. We go, we about to get wasted. All right, we about to. Can see your deck? All right. Watch your mouth, man. Watch your mouth. We here. We here. Watch your mouth, nigga. Nigga, watch your mouth, nigga. Nigga, watch your mouth, nigga. Nigga, 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 even before I made this video, I said, you know what, tonight I'm taking it easy with the bombs. Y'all see the shit I retweeted. My man sent a picture of a bomb blowing up, and I was like, okay. Let's go. Oh, real quick. Let me show y'all something real quick. Matter of fact, we got to pause real quick. I want to show y'all something. I want to show y'all something real quick. Okay. Real quick, before we get back to the stream. What's it? I want to show y'all something. Let's, um... I gotta take it to Facebook because I want I want y'all to see something real quick, and I gotta I want to I want to I want to have a drink and a shout out for one of these cats. Let me um let me let me find this shit. Let me see if I can find this shit real quick. Talk amongst yourself while I'm looking for this shit. Let's go to uh, messages. Let's see if I can find this shit. I got a message from one of the homies here. Let me see. Let's, let's see. All right, stream. Uh <laughs> Hey, whatever, man. Stream, just, 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 just chill out for a minute. Chill out for one minute. Uh, talk amongst yourself. Talk amongst yourself. Have a drink. Have a Sip drink. Up. Don't go, don't go crazy. Have fun. All right, I can't find the shit right now, but um, let, let me see. Um, <laughs> let me see if I can. Let me see if I can find this shit. Was it Frank? Let's see. Oh yeah. Okay. Good. Look. Now look, team. This, this, yes, this, this, this is something right here. Now, my man Frank Heinkel. Heinkel. Now, I don't, I don't like to get emotional on that shit. My man Frank Frank Heinkel is out on deployment. All right, out, oh, out, right, out, out. out. My man Frank me. is out. Look, look, yo, stream. Oh, let's have a drink real quick yes. for my man Frank. Sip up. Let me take that yeah, real quick. My man Frank. All right, my man Frank. Look at this shit. Oh. My man Frank. Look what he's wearing, son. My man Frank is out on deployment right now. Protecting this motherfucking country. That's they, motherfucking they, real shit. This is that that's real shit. That's we, that's that look, shit no, look. Right this is how you gotta push it into, in, into perspective. We out here. We buying galaxy Chilling. watches. We having Chilling. fun. We drinking like, Hennessy and all that. We, we 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 getting busy. My man Frank is right now in in Iraq at another country. Now he got his own family. He got his moms, his you know his pops, his cousins, brothers, everybody that love him. You know what I'm saying? He could be home chilling on the stream on Twitter, bugging out and all that. The niggas, niggas in deployment right now in another country, fighting for this country. But um, he took the time out to hit me up and show me his guy uh, gear to ask me some questions. And y'all know me, yo. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know me. Y'all know me. Look what I, look what I respond back, yo. You know what I'm saying? I salute a nigga, yo. You know what I'm saying? This is what I'm talking about, yo. I make videos for the real niggas, everybody out there, the real cats. And I, like I said, I'll say it again. I, I, my man Frankie, I'm going to salute you right now. T, you see me? I'm saluting mine the camera. Uh, mad hard. I'm, yo, T, me and T saluting you mad hard. Uh, <laughs> and look, I, I, I almost hit T in the throat with that salute. Uh, work, work. Wop, nigga. Yo, back up, nigga. Matter of fact, hold on. Wait a yo. What yo, my man, doing? my, 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 my yo, Frankie. They don't do that. Man. I'm about to salute you. I'm saluting you, I'm saluting you with dog. the big dog knife. Hold on. I'm, I'm, I'm <laughs> saluting you with the big dog knife. From my man Frankie right there, yo. Get home safe, y'all. Yo, yo, hope you get home for Thanksgiving and all that. Yes. Look, that's what it's all about, yo. All right, this this niggas out here protecting and serving, protecting the country. All right, the country that we live in, the country that we love. 
You know what I'm saying? All this bullshit, all that patriotism shit. Yeah, you know, all right. I'm, you know, a I'm, lot of people, they think so simple. We, as people, we could think so simple at, at, at times about shit. But it's really it's about real shit. It's other shit. You know it's other shit going it's down. It's more, it's more than just phones and tablets and toys and all that. You, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot yes, of shit. That's yes, why yes. when the nigga hit me up and was like, yo, I watched the Amazon Warrior videos while I'm, you know, while I got, you know, I'm, I'm out there in the field. Then I gotta come back to my my tent and shit, and um, we sit back and we got the computer. Me and my boys, we watch the Amazon Warrior video. We unwind, we relax, a little piece of home and all that. That's what that's what motivates me. That's what keeps me going. That's what keeps me hype. And you know what I'm saying? It's niggas like that exactly why I make these type of videos. All right, niggas that appreciate the shit and um, I respect that shit. I have nothing but respect. All right, let's see. Um, I got my man Jess Ricky on the check in. What's up? Come to New Orleans, so I have I, I have y'all try out our drinks, yo. Hurricane and hand grenades. All right? Like, I heard, I heard <laughs> you will turn. Number size string gangsters. Not turned up. He said you will get turned. Yeah. All right? If we fuck with the hurricanes and the hand grenades, we will get turned. Honey, and that that's show? what I'm talking what's about. I want to get turned. That they was, uh... What's the show that we will watch on Wednesdays? And they just change it. It's about clowns in the circus. Remember the last. Oh, the um, the fucking um, American, <laughs> American Horror, Horror Story. Story yeah. Yes. Yeah, yo, New Orleans, yo. Yeah, All right, so <laughs> my man, just Ricky, I will come out there, but just like I, yo, don't we, take me. We don't do demons. It's a, we do. We don't do all that other shit. Drinks. We, we do, do the drinks and food. do not. Or I repeat, <laughs> do not take me to where they filmed the first forty eight at. Wherever that's at in New Orleans, we, do we not take me there. All right, because we we already came from Brooklyn. Brooklyn, we are not interested in going nowhere where they got a whole bunch of crimes and shit, alright? So my man, Just Ricky, yeah, yo, we, we, I would definitely try the hurricane and the hand grenade, I'll bring you out to New if you come to New York, me and T will take you to get you an Incredible Hulk, alright, we'll get you an Incredible Hulk, we'll get you some, um, <laughs> some of these hood drinks that y'all niggas never heard of, we'll get you some of them shits, it is what it is. Alright, let's see, my man, the boy Jay. Checking in from Atlanta. Number sign stream gangsters, all right? The boy Jay. Yo, At Atlanta's on deck. We see you, all right? I, I haven't been to ATL in about a couple of years, yo. <laughs> last, last, last time I went to ATL, yo. Yo, let me tell you something. Last time I went to ATL. <laughs> last time I went to ATL. Yo, I'm on the phone. I'm on the, I'm on the phone with T. I'm mad drunk now. <laughs> I'm mad drunk. I'm, I, I went to, I think it was IHOP. I ordered about I, remember, I, I ordered about sixty dollars worth of IHOP, yo. That's, pause that. Excuse me. Remember, you was on your way to there. You had to pull over on the side. The <laughs> I, I'm mad drunk. I'm, I'm in Atlanta. I'm mad drunk and lost. Now I'm. I, I don't condone the drinking and driving. Yeah, no, I don't do that. I remember that. I don't. Kiss I don't drink you, and drive. I, I do not that, drink and drive. I remember that kiss before you got no place. Don't, don't tell nobody about that. Don't tell nobody about that. Don't, don't, don't tell nobody about that. I remember that kiss. What you do? So I'm, I'm out in ATL. I yo yo the boy Jay. I'm out in ATL. I'm mad wasted. Mm -hmm. I took my sister. We went to a family reunion. I took my sister and my Ooh, cousin, and all of them. Up. Nah, I was with yeah, I was with Fatima. I was with when all of them. Got there, yes. Yeah, me and Mook got me, me and Mook went out there together. That's when we raced those the Mustangs. Mustang I, 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 yo, Shut yo, up. son, I I did what I do. Yo, I did what I do. Now, after the party, I'm mad drunk, super drunk. I'm used to I'm used to that New York life, nigga. You drunk, you just you know you don't drive home, you cruise home, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So I'm I'm drinking and cruising. I'm not drinking and driving. I'm drinking, I'm not drinking, I'm not drinking, I'm not drinking and cruising. See, it's on Facebook, it's on Facebook though, it's on Facebook though. Put that picture. All right. So anyway, I'm dri I'm driving back from the club, back to my hotel room and shit. I see I see police. I'm like, oh shit, I gotta dip to the side. I dipped off to some little back streets in the middle, like some forest type shit. I'm in the car, mad scared. I'm like, yo, I'm about to get lynched out here, yo, man. Up in the cut somewhere. I waited like about an hour <laughs> in the car to sob up a little. I drive over to IHOP. That's how you know I'm drunk. I ordered about seventy dollars worth of food. Now look. I don't give I don't give a fuck what state you live in. In any state, seventy dollars in IHOP is a lot. I get back to the hotel room. I, I'm eating all this food. I'm talking to T on the phone. I fall asleep. I wake up the next morning. I look I look on the bed. I'm in literally I'm in the bed with with cheeseburgers on the side of me, onion rings everywhere, there's chicken fingers, fucking mozzarella sticks. 
yo, chicken sandwiches. Yo, you you understand, fellas? I, I don't give a fuck. I, I be I be doing dumb shit like that. There was so much food in that hotel room. It was amazing. Yo, it was it was the whole bed. I, I got a big giant bed. I'm there for Dolo. I got a whole bed full of food. <laughs> I woke up, I caught her in the phone, I'm like, yo, what happened last night? She's like, yo, son, you was mad wasted last night, yo, you fell asleep on the phone and shit, you, you know, T, you know, Hashtag Al, A-O-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-W-
Let's get back into the street. All right, let's let's, let's get back. Now I got a backlog you too. Did that. You did that. I got I got a backlog. I got a backlog. T T getting me wasted over here. Y'all see this shit? T got me. Very special. <laughs> I heard that, T. I heard that. I heard that. I heard that. See, I, I got my Frank White shit on deck at all times. At all times. All right? So, Elo. So, Elo. T, T back here having a photo shoot, taking mad selfies, taking mad pictures. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, huh? Okay, I'm trying to find the picture of you and Mook in the. So, on Facebook, yeah. Go to, go to the Facebook. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, okay, okay, okay. okay. I see, I, I see a couple. Of, I see the team floors bracelet, nigga. We had them shits back in the day.